Yo guys, what is up? Davis here. This is the Viper Dolan Corona that I saw, that you saw in the other video. I just made a video about it the other day. And this is the one. So it's all put together. It has the uh, MW3 cutout. With the, this was cut out with a CNC machine. It's got the sand at this drive. It has remote LEDs. And then if you hold the sync button, it'll switch the NAND. So it blinks twice. That means you're on the second NAND. If you hold it again, it means you're on the first NAND. If it blinks just once. So automatically when you plug it in, it's on the first NAND, which is the retail NAND. I can plug it back in. So it should boot up instantly. And you can also see the glitch. Like this is when uh, the H chip is glitching. They also want it blue and uh, white ring of light with the color changing middle LED. This is the remote. You want it music LEDs, not remote, sorry. So uh, it has remote options, so the fourth one is the best, uh, actually. So, so you know, it, it blinks to sound. Dylan, go ahead and play some song real quick. While he's doing that, I'm going to sync the controller. And as you see when I'm talking, it, it hears me, and it's blinking to the voice. So we switch to the RGH side. Alright. And then turn the controller on. Then we can go to the XX menu. And as you hear that sound, everybody's yelling. That's uh, my grandpa watching TV right now. Um, so he's got some mod menus on there. And he's got plugins. He's got everything ready to go. And I'm going to go right now and set up the fan and the um, update dash launch. So it's a Corona, as you see. Temperatures will be better once I turn the fan up. Alright guys, so there, that's it. That's the console, so go ahead and check out my other videos if you like this console. Because it seems to like me because the LEDs like to blink. So, anyway guys, you have a good day.